Get ready for Brainscape's ultimate American history flashcard quiz. What 16th and 17th century Christian sect wanted to eliminate religious practices not specifically named in the Bible and were consequently seen as a threat to the Church of England? The Puritans. What is the common term for the Puritans who fled from England between 1620 and 1640 to settle in colonial America? The Pilgrims. What is the main reason the English settlers initially coexisted peacefully with the Native Americans of New England? For trade and bartering. Which famous Native American princess befriended Captain John Smith of the colonial settlement at Jamestown, Virginia? Pocahontas. What was the first permanent English colony in the New World? Jamestown, Virginia. What was the term for the form of labor where a person's passage to the New World was paid in advance in exchange for several years of labor? Indentured servitude. What labor-intensive crops were initially responsible for Virginia's rapid imports of African slaves in the late 1600s? Rice and indigo. Between 1700 and 1750, where in the world did most American immigrants come from? England, Scotland, Ireland, Germany, Africa. What war took place from 1754 to 1763, in which Britain fought for control of the American colonial frontier? The French and Indian War. What law did the British Parliament pass in 1765 to charge a tax on all official documents and newspapers in the American colonies? The Stamp Act. Which famous historical event began as a street brawl between American colonists and a lone British soldier, but quickly escalated into a bloodbath? The Boston Massacre. In 1773, Massachusetts colonists staged a protest in retaliation to the Crown passing the Tea Act, dumping many tons of tea into the harbor. What did their protest become known as? The Boston Tea Party. What nickname was given to the well-prepared subset of colonial militia that were trained to respond to threats within a moment's notice? Minutemen. On April 18, 1775, what American colonist famously rode 13 miles overnight to warn Massachusetts militias, the British are coming? Paul Revere. What were the names of the first two battles of the American Revolutionary War? Lexington and Concord. Whom did the Second Continental Congress dispatch to take command of the American soldiers in their fight against the British military in 1775? George Washington. Who wrote the pamphlet Common Sense, which advocated for immediate independence from the British in 1776? Thomas Paine. In 1776, what famous document did the Second Continental Congress send to King George III, asserting the American colony's formal separation from Great Britain? The Declaration of Independence. Which 18th century American politician and president of the Continental Congress was the first to sign the Declaration of Independence? John Hancock. Which American founding father and Declaration of Independence signee later became the second president of the United States? John Adams. Which American founding father co-founded the U.S. financial system and became the first Secretary of the Treasury? Alexander Hamilton. Which founding father was the main author of the Declaration of Independence and became the third president of the United States? Thomas Jefferson. Which founding father was a talented inventor, scientist, statesman, writer, and printer? Benjamin Franklin. After the United States declared independence from Britain on July 4, 1776, what document was drafted to govern the new nation? The Articles of Confederation. What was the term for the American loyalists who fought on the side of the British or otherwise aided them in the war against the American colonies? Tories. Which American general of the Revolutionary War famously plotted to betray the Americans by siding with the British in 1779? Benedict Arnold. 
During the revolution, which country was America's most important ally? France. Which document is the fundamental law of the U.S. federal system and delineates the national frame of government? The United States Constitution. What three branches of American government were established by the Constitution? Legislative, Judiciary, Executive. What famous agreement was reached at the 1787 Constitutional Convention, which decreed that slaves could count as a fraction of a person when establishing the state's representation in Congress based on population? Three-fifths compromise. What legal process is followed to initiate formal charges against an elected official suspected of a crime or impropriety with the goal of removing them from office? Impeachment. What was the name for the U.S. states who wished to ratify the U.S. Constitution in the period of 1788 to 1789 while it was still under review? Federalists. What term is used for the first 10 constitutional amendments supporting the guarantee of individual liberty? Bill of Rights. Which two Americans led a two-year expedition to explore the American West to study its terrain, wildlife, natural resources, and geography? Lewis and Clark. What was the term for the American acquisition of a great swath of Western territory from France that nearly doubled the former country's total land area? The Louisiana Purchase. Which two countries fought in the War of 1812? the United States, and the United Kingdom. Who invented the steamboat, revolutionizing travel on America's waterways? Robert Fulton. Which of Eli Whitney's inventions made it economical to use cotton to manufacture a clothing? Cotton gin. What was the major source of power for America's earliest factories? Water power. What was the main reason a million Irish immigrants fled their homeland between 1845 and 1852? The Irish Potato Famine. What were the American South's three primary exports in the years preceding the Civil War? Tobacco, cotton, rice. Which belief, argued by American philosopher Henry Thoreau, says that one has a duty to disobey when the government enacts laws that violate one's conscience. Civil disobedience. What phrase coined in 1845 posited that the United States was intended by God to rule all of North America? Manifest destiny. In 1831, what massive slave revolt in Virginia was so impactful on the Southern psyche that it ended all meaningful discussion of slavery reform. Nat Turner's Rebellion. What 1836 event, which was a massacre by the Mexican army, fueled the vengeance fire that ultimately resulted in Texas's independence? The Siege of the Alamo. What driving force attracted 300,000 settlers from the Eastern US to California from 1848 to 1855? The Gold Rush. In the 19th century, what was the nickname for the network of secret routes that guided escaped slaves to their freedom? The Underground Railroad. What landmark decision by the Supreme Court held that African Americans could not be American citizens and therefore could not bring suit in federal court? Dred Scott versus Sanford. In 1861, who was elected in early as president of the Confederacy? Jefferson Davis. Which 19th century American politician served as president of the United States and governed the Union during the Civil War? Abraham Lincoln. What executive order was issued by Abraham Lincoln to free millions of slaves? Emancipation Proclamation. Which military and political leader served as a Union Army general during the Civil War and later became the 18th President of the United States? Ulysses S. Grant. Which American general commanded the Confederate troops during the Civil War? Robert E. Lee. Which Civil War battle marked the end of the Confederacy's offensive capabilities? The Battle of Gettysburg. What 1866 legislation did Congress pass in response to the South's Black Codes? 
the Civil Rights Act. During the post-war's Reconstruction era, what domestic terrorist organization sought to intimidate and suppress newly freed African Americans? The Ku Klux Klan. Which 19th century American writer and abolitionist was an escaped slave known for his oratory, anti-slavery writings, and support of women's suffrage? Frederick Douglass. Which American civil rights organization was founded by W.E.B. Du Bois to advance justice for African Americans in the 19th and 20th centuries? The National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, or NAACP. What was the phrase used by the American South to justify segregation under the Constitution? Separate but equal. After the Civil War, which set of laws was passed to continue the discrimination against the disenfranchisement of African Americans in the South? The Jim Crow Laws. Which two railroads were joined to create the first transcontinental railroad? The Central Pacific Railroad and the Union Pacific Railroad. Going by the nickname Commodore, who was the 19th century American industrialist who made his fortune in railroads and shipping? Cornelius Vanderbilt. What was the name of the poor Scottish immigrant who became one of the wealthiest and most important American industrialists and philanthropists in the 19th and early 20th centuries due to his success in the steel business? Andrew Carnegie. Who invented the light bulb and was known as the Wizard of Menlo Park? Thomas Alva Edison. Which notorious New York politician controlled Tammany Hall during the 1860s and 1870s? Boss Tweed. Which American author and activist was deaf and blind but learned to write, read, and communicate through sign language? Helen Keller. Which American war hero and politician known as Teddy was president of the United States from 1901 to 1909? Theodore Roosevelt. Who were the two early leaders of the National American Women's Suffrage Association formed in 1890? Elizabeth Cady Stanton, Susan B. Anthony. Who developed and led the New York Journal, the nation's largest newspaper chain in the early 1900s? William Randolph Hearst. Who was the 28th president of the United States, known for his attempts to keep America out of World War I? Woodrow Wilson. During the first few years of World War I, which three nations were the primary Allied powers? France, Great Britain, Russia. Which four nations were known as the Central Powers in World War I? Germany, Austria-Hungary, the Ottoman Empire, Bulgaria. What treaty formally ended the First World War? The Treaty of Versailles. Which production method was innovated by Henry Ford to streamline production? Assembly line production. What was the name of the era that took place after the 18th Amendment to the U.S. Constitution banned the manufacture, transportation, and sale of intoxicating liquors? Prohibition. In the late 1920s and early 1930s, which Chicago-based American gangster led a crime syndicate that was primarily focused on the illegal sale of alcohol. Al Capone. Which pair of outlaws gained considerable attention in the 1930s for robberies they committed in the central United States? Bonnie Parker and Clyde Barrow. Which 20th century aviator was the first woman to fly an airplane across the Atlantic Ocean in 1932? Amelia Earhart. What's the name of the 1920s New York City-based artistic and intellectual movement that expressed pride in African-American culture? Harlem Renaissance. What U.S. president led the country through the Great Depression and most of World War II, serving a record of 12 years from 1933 to 1945? Franklin Delano Roosevelt. Which historic event in 1929 led to the Great Depression? The stock market crash. Which series of relief programs were announced by President Roosevelt to help America recover and reform after the Great Depression? The New Deal. 
What U.S. military base did Japan strike in 1941, bringing the U.S. into World War II against the Axis powers? Pearl Harbor. In World War II, what became the term for the moment in 1944 that the Allies landed on the beach in Normandy, France? D-Day. Which bill was passed by the Congress in 1944 to provide a range of benefits for returning World War II veterans? The GI Bill. Which American president led the United States in the final months of World War II and made the controversial decision to use atomic weapons against Japan to end the war? Harry S. Truman. Who was the first director of the Federal Bureau of Investigation, FBI? J. Edgar Hoover. What is the term given by historians and demographers for the massive growth in population that occurred in the United States between 1946 and 1957? Baby boom. Who was the president of the United States from 1953 to 1961? a period marked by great economic prosperity. Dwight D. Eisenhower. Which prolonged conflict from 1945 to 1991 was a long-standing state of political and military tension between the Soviet Union and the United States and NATO nations? The Cold War. Which American senator led efforts in the 1940s and 1950s to root out communists in the American government and society? Joseph R. McCarthy. Which 20th century African American clergyman and politician was the most prominent leader of the civil rights movement until his assassination in April 1968? Martin Luther King Jr. Which African-American civil rights activist famously refused to give up her seat for a white person on a Montgomery, Alabama bus in 1955? Rosa Parks. Who was president of the United States from 1961 to 1963, and at 43, the youngest person to be elected to the office? John F. Kennedy. In an operation approved by President Kennedy, what event saw Cuban dissidents funded by the CIA invading Cuba to overthrow Fidel Castro's communist government. Bay of Pigs invasion. What 1962 crisis was initiated with the shocking discovery of Soviet nuclear weapons in Cuba by an Air Force U-2 spy plane? Cuban Missile Crisis. Which 20th century African-American Muslim minister and political leader broke with the Nation of Islam in 1964 to work with civil rights leaders. Malcolm X. Which party advocated militant self-rule for African Americans in the late 1960s and was characterized by distinct all-black attire? Black Panthers. Who was the alleged killer of President John F. Kennedy? Lee Harvey Oswald. In 1968, which two U.S. political leaders were assassinated within only a few days of each other? Martin Luther King Jr., Robert F. Kennedy. In 1969, which American engineer, pilot, Navy officer, and astronaut became the first person to walk on the moon? Neil Armstrong. Who was the 37th U.S. president whose term became so embroiled in scandal that he resigned in 1974? Richard Nixon. What was U.S. President Nixon's plot to spy on his opponents for political gain called after it was uncovered? The Watergate Scandal. Which German-born American writer and diplomat served as National Security Advisor and Secretary of State under Presidents Nixon and Ford? Henry Kissinger. Which American film actor began his political career in the 1960s becoming governor of California and later the 40th president of the United States? Ronald Reagan. Which U.S. lawyer became the first African-American Supreme Court justice, serving from 1967 to 1991? Thurgood Marshall. Appointed by President Reagan in 1981, who was the first woman to serve on the Supreme Court? Sandra Day O'Connor. Which American politician served as the 42nd president of the United States from 1993 to 2001? Bill Clinton. Loving our flashcard quizzes? 
keep studying in the Brainscape app.